What's up Lego fans, it's Wittick Bricks here, and today I have a pretty small review for you guys. This is the Geonosis Starfighter, sub number 7959, recommended for ages 7 to 12. Um, now I am just saying you guys will notice there are no characters or instruction manuals sitting out. When we purchased the set, we got it off ebay.com, which is a used selling place. You can bid there, uh, buy there, and, or just make offers. Lots of different things you can do on that website. We bought this, and they said um, after we bought it, we so we were basically forced to buy it this way. They told us it had no characters with it, so you know that was kind of annoying. But it's still a cool ship, and I think it's it's definitely worth reviewing because um, it's just it has a lot of cool details in it. So let's start out with the nose of it, and you can see here on the front, it's it's basically two layers combined by this layer right here, and that uh, holds the entire thing together. I like the way the front sort of leads up to this cockpit, um, and then the cockpit is right here. Um, again, that's where a character would set, but because I don't have the characters, I can't be showing that. There is a little control panel there. Uh, you can see right there is just a small one by 2 tiled control panel there. Not much to show about the interior. Oh, I did want to point out there is no studs in there, so it's a lot easier to remove. He just fits in there, and then you can pull him out. Um, on the second layer, there is a cannon here. You can see. I uh, like the way this overall looks. Um, I think it, I think it definitely has a, a nice detail to it. I just wish they would have placed something else on it to, to give it just a little more detail. I think it's nice, nicely detailed, just maybe a little bit more could have been. Uh, it, it does a 180 degree turn, and um, that's nice. It doesn't really need to do a 180 degree turn because if you turn the missile this far, you wouldn't really be able to shoot. So um, it's still nice being able to do that that turn though. Um, over here we get these two uh, satellites placed upside down. I'm not sure what those are for. Not 100% sure what those are for, but I think they're nice. Um, this the overall detail in here I think is very nice. And uh, did want to point out on the bottom if somebody is underneath you firing up, or if somebody's underneath you that's an enemy, you always need to be able to uh, fire below. So obviously you're going to get a cannon right here, that's why you see the clips um, pulls right out, and I think that was done very nicely. Here's the missile, and I'll demonstrate in just a minute. I think that was done very nicely because of this 2x4 uh, tile piece here. And that was done very nicely, it just fits right in with the rest of the ship. Here's what it looks like when it's coming out from underneath. Let me get this open. And that's what it looks like. So it is a really nice set. Again, it has a lot of uh, detailed pieces on it. I like it. Again, I don't have the characters, but it's still a cool set. Guys, be sure to like this video. Get, leave a comment down below. Um, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.